Today, I'm going to show you how to combine multiple CSV files into one CSV file. This works with CSVs, Excel sheets, whatever the case may be. So step one is gonna be create a new folder. Now I'm on Mac, so if you're not on a Mac, stop watching this video. Right click, create a new folder, and I'm just gonna call it combine, right? So the next thing I'm gonna do is uh, take all of my CSV files and just put them in that folder. So if I open my combine folder here, I will see all my CSV files nicely in that folder. Everything in this folder is going to be combined, so make sure that if there's something in here you don't want smushed together, get it out. Step two, we're gonna open terminal. You can open your terminal by uh, typing command, holding the command key and pressing shift and then typing terminal. Um, that'll pull it up. Or if you want to, you can just go to your applications folder and find utilities and then find terminal. All right, so when your terminal is open, it's going to look like this. The next thing you wanna do is figure out where the terminal is, right? Um, so just follow along, type PWD as it shows in the article below. And it shows me that I'm on the users Devon area, right? So what I wanna do is make sure that I go from users Devon, that's the user I'm logged into. Uh, yours will probably say your name. And then this is a folder on my desktop. So what I wanna do is get into this folder. I want the terminal to be in that folder not on the Devon directory. So the way I do that is I have this little script here and I will type CD space and then the file path right here. It is in the article, you can copy and paste it in. Uh, mine is slash users slash Devon slash desktop slash combine because we called our folder combine. So you'll type that in and you'll press enter. Uh, the next thing you wanna do is, this is where we merge the files. So we have another little script and we are going to uh, I'm just going to paste it in here. You can type it or paste it. It's in the article and it's CAT space and then the star dot CSV space. Well, whatever you can see it, right? And this thing right here is what my new CSV file is going to be called. Um, I recommend just doing it and you can change the name later. So I've typed it in and I press enter and that's pretty much it. Now, when you open your folder, you will see that there is a CSV file here called combined and you can see it is 4.2 megabytes. It's way bigger than all the other ones because they have all been combined into one. So that's really it. Um, if you're using a Mac, that's how you combine multiple CSVs. And um, now if you wanna rename it, you can go ahead and do that. So thanks for watching. And if you have any more questions about SEO, digital marketing, productivity tips for your business, or if you just want to um, bring more traffic to your site and help grow your business, join us at serpuniversity.com. See ya.